Goblins ahead. We'll need a cover. Look it, Claw. Sapper's here. Unless you've got another reason to be here. Feck sight. As the symbol glows, power courses through you. Authority. This better not be Minthara's messenger. If the boss finds out I gave him our time, that's me done. Oh, right. Beg pardon. Gotta give all the visitors the old squinty eye, you know. Uh, go on in and have a drink for me, eh? Who? If he ain't one of us, and if he's here, he's down in the pits. Save the druid if you must. If we spill goblin blood on the way, all the better. Heh! <laughs> Depends who you are. We're celebrating a raid. No, get yourself a bit of fun before it dries up. Rip the guts out of Joaquin's rest, we did. Lads even captured some Duke. Worth celebrating, that is. Singing, we'll know who sent them. I might be, we'll pay him a visit in return. That'll be some real fun. <laughs> in Moonrise want to look at you for... Certainly you won't be because of your beautiful eyes. Juicing it up. The beast came in here with those robbers, killed Dink and Mince too. Boss is thinking of serving it to the wargs. And it makes funny noises. We made it squeal. Look, look, you'll see. Give me that rock. I'll show you. Uh, uh, yes, uh, of course. Something stirs deep within you, hungry and alert. It's taking something you'll never get back. But... but I want to hear it squeal. One, that's a true soul you're talking to. Show some respect. S sorry sir. I'll open the cage for you. Sizes you up, wary but not yet attacking. Uh. 
Pardon the viscera. One should cherish all of nature's bounty, but goblin guts are quite far down the list. You aided a bear without knowing if it would savage you. <laughs> a true friend of nature. Or perhaps a lunatic. Either way, I owe thanks. I am the druid Halson. I must admit, I didn't expect anyone would come to my aid. Who? Hmm. That look in your eyes. I've seen it before. Are you feeling all right? <sighs> Oak Father, preserve you, child. You're infected, aren't you? The Mind Flayer's spawn. But... Something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the Absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? It's no coincidence that you found me here, I'll wager. You're after a cure for this parasite. I've been studying these parasites for a while now. Ever since I discovered these so-called true souls are infected with them, someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic, which means I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. I didn't find what I came here for, a way to remove the tadpoles, but... I found the next best thing. I found out where they come from. That must be where these enchantments are placed on them. And it's where you'll find your cure. I overheard that the cultists are sending all of their captives to Moonrise Towers. Innocents go in, true souls come out. Given that all of these true souls are infected, it has to be the source for this magic. If you want to find a cure, you must head there and discover how the tadpoles are being manipulated. Oh, wait, I could help you find a cure. But I need to settle matters here first. I've no right to ask more of you. But if you could help me, I'd be free to join your journey to Moonrise. I cannot allow these butchers to threaten my grove. The natural order must be protected. My thanks. If you prevail, I'll owe you the debt of a lifetime. Rare is the beast that survives decapitation. Help me eliminate the drow Minthara, the hobgoblin draw Ragslin, and that perversion of a priestess, Gut. They are the ones holding these parasites together. Remove them. And nature will cure itself. Be warned. My presence could make things more difficult. I can only restrain my bear form so much. I won't be able to help but attack goblins. If I join you, we'll likely have to slaughter this entire place. You may want to use discretion when approaching the goblin leaders. So be it. May Sylvanus lend us nature's fury. You took it upon yourself to undertake the right of thorns. I ought to exile you from this place. Forever. Instead, I shall listen to the explanation that you owe me. 
I owe you nothing. Goblins swarmed us like roaches while you stumbled after the past. You chose to abandon us. I chose to protect us. Silence! The right has been ended. I will allow you to stay, but consider yourself a novice anew. You have forgotten the ways of the druids, our place in the natural order. You shall learn it all once again, right here. Backslide, and nature's fury will crush you. As you wish, Master Helsin. A misjudgment. One that should weigh heavily upon her. But the Grove still needs her passion. You will soon see why. But enough of that for now. I owe you my thanks. The Grove stands. Nature prevails. I owe you my thanks. And an introduction. I am Halsin, first druid of the Emerald Grove. And I sense you have a problem you seek my help with. It's true. I can feel it right now. Oh, Oak Father, preserve you, child. But something's different. You're aware of the monster inside you. You don't bow to the Absolute like the true souls do. How is this possible? Someone is using very powerful magic to modify these tadpoles. They're using them to exert control over the infected. I'm sorry to say, I can't undo that magic. I can't cure you. But that doesn't mean I can't help. At the goblin camp, I hoped to find a way to remove the tadpoles. I failed, but I did find the next best thing. I found out where they come from. I will do what I can to help you. Let us speak tomorrow. You and I both have matters to see to first. As for what you've done for the Grove, speak to Wrath. He will see to your reward. Believe me, it is. The span of a mortal life isn't enough to grasp the importance of this place. Its roots touch everything. Make peace with all who shelter here. It is We're ready to head to your camp. Are you? You have no idea how good it feels. The singing we could probably do without. through for us. That's a change from most adults I know. I'm not. Just like I'll be glad to be... Wish I could have kicked that goblin king in the head. Go on, do your rounds. But if they hand you something purple, don't drink.
I trust you enjoyed your evening? After all your... It may be some time before you're afforded another such night. I'm certain a cure for you can be found at Moonrise. The journey specifically, it's extremely per... Finally, we're catching up on our puppet master. And the hunt ends at Moonrise Towers. What were you expecting? I won't be held accountable just because you're naive enough to expect to get to the towers. You'll need to pass through it. This curse shrouds everything in shadow. Any who linger are twisted by the curse. They become shadow beings, tormented, dangerous. You could go overland. Along you could also go under. There is a tunnel somewhere in long ago. A man called Ketherick Thorne built a secret Dark Justicius. Must Aridan and his lot were looking from this stronghold. If you can find this place, I'll wager it will reveal a more direct path to Moonrise Towers. Already? I would like to join your camp, if you'll allow me. I've long sought to return to Moonrise Towers. It seems our fates have aligned. May Sylvanus...